This is a video explaining how to do some of the calculations for part B of lab number one, um, TLC volatility and heat of solution. That's the volatility part is part B. All right, so one of the things that you're going to need to calculate is the mole fraction of methanol. To do that, you just take the moles of methanol divided by the total moles in the solution, N sub T. So first of all, to get the moles of methanol, you measured out 2.50 milliliters of methanol in your 25% solution. I'm going to walk you through the calculations for the 25% solution, and you can figure out the other ones. So you measured out 2.50 milliliters of methanol. Multiply that of volume times the density, which I gave you, and that gives you the mass of methanol in that solution. Next, take the mass of methanol dividing by the molar mass of methanol and it gives you the moles of methanol. Do the same sort of thing for the ethylene glycol. For that 25% solution, you measured out 7.50 milliliters of ethylene glycol times the density of ethylene glycol, which I gave you. And now you have the mass of ethylene glycol. Just take the mass divided by the molar mass. That gives you the moles of ethylene glycol. Now we're going to calculate the total moles in solution, the bottom part for the mole fraction equation, adding together the moles of methanol and the moles of ethylene glycol. Calculated both of these. And now we have total moles in solution. Finally, to calculate the mole fraction of methanol in your 25% solution, take the moles of methanol divided by the total moles. You know both these numbers, put them in, and you get the answer, 0 .0, 0 0.315.